What's going on everybody, Michael McWhorter here. Today we're gonna go ahead and review some more AI tools like we normally do. Please stick to the end of the video because these AI tools are really cool. They actually make your life a lot easier. Your day to day gets uh, quite breezy. So if you would please, let's tag along. Behold, the awesome site. This is a really cool site that I like to go to. It's called Future Tools where there's a ton of AI tools that cover things in a wide range. You got like 2,500 and counting. The other day I was here, it was like 2,400. So there's like 150 getting added quite frequently. They keep growing up and up. Long story short, they do things like finance and marketing and research and prompt. They do just about anything you can really think of. I like coming down here to the most upvoted section. And with that, you can see that some of these have thousands of upvotes. So they can help you code. They can help you generate video. They can help you enhance your speech. So AI voice augmentation and many, many more. I've already reviewed all of these. If you want, you can check them out on my channel. Uh, we're gonna go till we don't see any more blue upticks anymore because I've upvoted some and not uploaded others just because um, how I feel, personal opinion. But I have reviewed all of these. So we need to get to where we were. And first up on the list, we got Run Diffusion. Run Diffusion is a cloud-based tool that allows users to quickly and easily launch a dedicated server to use software such as Automatic 111, 1111, and Invoke AI. Servers boot. Long story short, it is a uh, it's a thing. We're gonna go explore it. I'm not really sure what to make of it. It looks like a welcome to Run Diffusion. We have a lot of different apps that you get to choose from, like AI Art. We generally recommend you first try Focus. It's a great way to get started. So we will try Focus for a beginner start is very intuitive very quick trial balance 25 cents by clicking launch you agree to stable diffusions license and restrictions you agree not to use tools that generate anything explicit and you pretty much will not be bad okay focus small current release date january 18th multi-sessions we're setting everything up for you right now take about 60 seconds to three minutes depending on selection you're not getting charged for the startup time we'll wait fill out a survey i don't think i want to wait i just want to start it I have no idea what that is. How proficient are you in OpenAI tools? I'll do like a three. Pretty, pretty proficient. Where did you find us? Ooh, other. Thanks. Join our Discord. Session is starting. So we will just wait for that to get done. I wonder what multi-sessions is. I don't want to click it because then we'll get stuck. But I will get back to you as soon as it's done. It has been completed. That wasn't too hard at all. It only took uh, about two three minutes so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna click extend stop why am i on a timer i don't know what i'm doing type prompt here or paste parameters let's say what can you do because i don't know what this does generate moving model to gpu i have no idea what run diffusion does but it looks pretty cool Ooh, Ooh look at that creating right in there yeah I guess it just makes some wicked art and wicked things it must be like a uh, click this learn get help I'm so sorry that this video is not the uh, the the most coherent but we're learning it as we go along and that's what matters so that's the preview and this is the finished image so it just creates super hyper realistic images oh my gosh Time timer. Oh, I guess we only have so much time. Eh, gross. Uh, tutorials. There we go. You know, I close my eyes. I get better pictures faster. Hello, my friends. How are you doing? Today, <laughs> I'm going to show. Great. Okay, so it is just image generation. All right, and you got to kind of set up some files here embed them and uh you know that just seems very complicated and it, there's a whole tutorial on how to get in there and make it super graphically enhanced and oh look at that you can even make like 3d models and stuff like that that's pretty wild I make mean, cowboy <laughs> god dang that's that's pretty cool yep and i guess you can highlight segments of the photo with a pen and it will go ahead and do in paint out paint let's just what you want to in paint write the prompt up here and click on generate 
this will generate the in painting for you. And then also below that you have here several selections for out painting. So on the left. Okay, let's go ahead and try that out. Ah, oh, it's complicated. I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> I want to, let's go ahead and do this. And I think we will, I want to in paint like he said, but I'm not sure how he did it. I mean, for the most part, it creates amazing images. Whoa, whoa. Server manager. Whoa, there's a lot going on there. Advanced. Oh, here's all the aspect ratios that he's just showing us. Style, model. Where is it? Where is it? Image number, random. Input image. Oh, that looks pretty good. In paint or out paint. Drag or drop image here. So I guess we can drag this image down into here. And then we can... Oh, actually, I want, I want the other one. I want this one. Yes. And then I want these gone see you just got to watch a quick little tutorial and that tutorial was like five seconds to watch as we just skimmed it together to figure out how it works so we're going to take these headphones off i want to see if it can it probably can if this is all ai generated then we have to let it know what we want out paint direction in paint direction and then we just go ahead and click or type remove headphones click generate I think it does this. I think this is how it works. While that's loading, we're going to come down here. Out paint direction. Let's do left. And bottom. I'm going to go ahead and click to sort of generate on that. Oh, look at that! It almost is kind of removing the headphones a little bit, I think. It's trying. Oh no, it's not doing so good. Oh, it's, it's trying to get rid of them. Hmm, might be using this tool wrong. Yeah, bot start there. Run Diffusion probably does a lot more than I know. And we're just going to go back to this real quick. A uh, cloud-based tool that allows users to quickly and easily launch a dedicated server. Servers in roughly two minutes you can easily generate images using a variety of preloaded models okay so it is an image generator like we discovered use tools like ControlNet and deform for image and video generation so it can do videos also they offer multiple server speeds with competitive pricing tiers hourly rate charged by the minute for pay as you go convenience there's a premium membership that grants users their own private storage along with more advanced features unlocked like dream booth training Laura training embedded training Custom model uploads and premium support. So we really didn't miss much there, except for the video generation. Um, we go here to the pricing. There it is right there. So 50 cents per hour. And you just continue to add funds. So you'll hook up your card here, and however many funds of video you want to make, it's 50 cents. So, I mean, it's not bad. 50 cents for an hour. The only problem is, if you don't like what you made the first time, you'll have to probably go in and edit it the second time and the third time, and that's where things can start to get expensive. So... Just something to look out for. Kind of cool. I won't upload it because maybe I didn't understand it too much. But uh, without further ado, we're going to jump onto the next AI tool because most of these AI tools, are, they get they get pretty good. You'll find one that's like a gold mine every other three. So that's what I like about this website. I've been to other AI tool websites, and they're great. Don't get me wrong. The other AI tool websites are great. But Future Tools is exceptional because it seems like almost every other tool has some hidden things in it that really just kind of like change your perspective like this one right here deep fakes where they create deep fake videos it's like drake right there doing a deep fake they're pretty wild of course i've already reviewed those Okay, our second and last tool, because this is going to be a short one, just kind of make it brief for you guys so you can kind of see some cool AI tools and what they can do, profilepicture.ai. 
Postcast Free PDF Maker is an online tool that allows you to create custom profile pictures for social media accounts, basically in any kind of style, in any kind of platform. We're going to jump right in, and you can see that it lets you generate AI profile pictures without a physical photo shoot, which is exceptional. You don't actually have to go out and be in public or in these places. So for $35 per person, you can get 120 shoots, three unique locations per shoot, and high quality photo size. Two hours done, fast turnaround. Why choose these? Because they're indistinguishable from real photos, no need for any physical shoot, and matching photos no matter where. They have a ton of reviews, allegedly, and a ton of reviews, and they're on a ton of different websites. Now let's get into the juice of it. Here we have Damon Chen, founder of Testimonial. Founder at Testimonial. And here are the photos that he provided, and then here are the photos that the AI generated. Pretty, pretty great. They say these photos are not real. They are created using AI headshot generator. Now we have Dustin Miller, co-founder at Vowel. You can see it has a smiling picture of him here, him in a suit, him in a dark room, him in a car, outside and stuff like that. And it takes it and just, it looks so great right there. That looks so nice. It's such a nice profile picture and there's no distortion. So it is very crisp and very clean. Again, we run down the line here. And you can't really tell that these are AI generated. I mean, if you just sit here and look at these for a second, you really can't tell that these are AI generated. It looks like it's a professional photo shoot. They take their quality very seriously. I'm not a sponsor, and I'm not sponsored by them. But here it has some comparisons. So, here is theirs. Just crisp, clean, dapper, and then it's known alternatives. And it's just obviously AI-generated, very sloppy, very blurry, no refund after usage. So, you get 14 days money back guaranteed on these. If you need a photo shoot for a professional job, and you don't have a $300 suit and they don't expect you to wear a $300 suit to work but you need to wear a $300 suit in order to put it on your resume you spend $35 and get a professional photo shoot with how many photos was it 120 headshots something I love is the background so you can put it over a cityscape a park matching poses clear and sharp choose your clothing and location and then this one's like random poses deformed faces the only thing i'm going to say now is that there are a lot of ai tools out there that can do this kind of similarly this one is probably one of the better ones i've seen because it is extremely clean very nice very well oriented and i think what part of this two hour turnaround is people reviewing the photos now there might be it going through a ton of cycles on the back end of AI generation where you send your photos in and then the AI takes your face and generates a completely new AI image with it and then just runs it through like a series of prompts that last like two hours until it gets a very nice crisp realistic photo whereas if you do like Dolly or something and I'm not discrediting Dolly by any means which is another known alternative uh, you, you might get something like this and who knows you know headshot pro might sometimes make a hallucination too like these over here but for the most part there are other ai tools that can do this this is just a clean one that i have seen headshot pro seems pretty clean like i said wide variety of backdrops and clothing and you could just get parks and cafes marinas gardens streets yellow change the colors change all the styles and look at this it looks like this person was in the same photo every single time now the only thing that i noticed is a little bit of this interesting neck construction here but it seems to maintain that all the way out all the way throughout now this one looks a little weird it looks a little elongated there and now i'm just nitpicking really This undersuit, this coat underneath the suit looks a little, little, um, elongated, but still very nice. Very, I mean, look, just, just first glance at these. Look at these. You could have these as a profile picture. These look very nice. And there's the pricing. So yeah, this was just a very basic, very quick video, very kind of, um, 
time efficient for you so that you don't have to sit around and wait to find out stuff like this. I just kind of wanted to put it up online so more people can see traction on it. I love reviewing AI tools. AI is the best. I'm going to go ahead and start getting myself into it, working like three jobs, going ahead and getting up more college degrees, and just, just cranking out AI, crank, cranking out AI content, reviewing AI constantly because I frankly love it. If there's anything you guys would like me to do for you, any kind of... Um, content, any kind of reviews, anything of that nature, let me know. Let me know in the comments section down below and I'll get back to you. I'm thinking about doing more financial reviews so that people can see how to make money with these things, how they can turn their own around because there are ways to do that. I just didn't do that in this video. So I can make more videos on that if you guys would like. Also, I want to start doing more controversial reviews, like integration with AI and mankind becoming integrated with machine. If you look, Elon Musk's Neuralink just started human trials. That's a little brain chip they put in your head. Maybe I'll do another review of that in another video. I, again, I love this AI stuff, this tech, all me, every day of the week. So if you guys like this video, please subscribe. That would mean the world to me. Leave a like if you would, please. And um, yeah, that's if you feel I have earned that. So yeah, really. You guys are the best. Thank you so much for watching. I hope I entertained you. Leave a comment down below, and I'll get back to you. You guys rock. Stay safe out there. Peace.